Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Simply Tanika Dion. I am your host, Dion. All right, as you can tell by the title, today I am going to be doing a BoxyCharm unboxing as well as some BoxyCharm add-ons that I got. And I actually got them for you guys because I will be doing a giveaway really, really soon. Um, no particular reason. I'm just going to be doing one. I just have to get all my things together. But of course, I'll let you guys know. Now, first of all, guys, can we just get into these beautiful, beautiful earrings, these Africa earrings, which I got courtesy of Monet Dior Couture. She recently had a 30% off spring sale. Now, this wasn't in the spring. But when I was on the website, I saw these and I just had to have them. So I got them um, as well as some of her spring stuff I got too. I got a bunch of bunch of stuff. And this is also a piece of hers is a layered necklace with a crystal. I'm not sure of the actual name, but the things will be listed in the description below. But you guys, you really need to check out Monet Couture Dior. That is her um, uh, website, her accessories line. Now she also has a channel where she reviews wigs and her channel name is Deanna Monet TV. Okay, all that will be linked below. But anywho, um, yeah, so I will go ahead and get started with this unboxing. Now, guys, I feel like I have not done an unboxing in so long because I recently, well, not recently, for a while, have been doing nothing. Well, I do some makeup in between, but mainly it's been wig, 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 wig. Because I haven't done an unboxing in a while. Um, this is my first unboxing probably since like January. Um, and no lie, guys, I still have my February and my March sitting right here and they have not been open. I still have my Glam Bag X, the very first one over here, never been opened. I don't wear makeup. Now, when I was working, guys, I wore makeup every day. That's how I built my collection because I wanted to wear different stuff every day. But when I got pregnant at age 40 and I decided to stop working a year after he was born, I don't know. I just don't wear makeup every day anymore. I just do not. Um, so yeah, that is, is it is what it is. But before y'all, I was uh, but okay. Let's go ahead now. Um, um, boxy charm. This is the boxy charm premium, and I'm surprised I have it this early. I always get my stuff in the end of the month, always. But anyway, boxy charm premium. Here we go. And Lord knows, I hope I'm on the right box because, like I said, I have boxes. <sighs> I have my boxes down here. Four boxes down here that's never been opened yet <sighs> from BoxyCharm. Oh my gosh. I'm not going to do those reviews. Like I said, I'm, I'm too late on those. So I'm not going to do those. I'll just open them and put the stuff away one day. I don't know. Um, but yeah, BoxyCharm is the only box that I get now. And I did cancel BoxyCharm. But when I didn't get it that one month, I was needy. I felt needy. I don't know. So I went ahead and started up all of them again. Uh, all three. The base, the premium, and the luxe. Um, yeah. So, you know. Um, so I think that may be why I got this one a little sooner. I don't know. Because they're supposed to be sending me a base box and a and a luxe starter. Because like I said, I, I started um, back up. So I don't know. I have no idea, you guys. But whatever. Anyway. Um, yeah, <laughs> this is it. And I believe this is the one I'm supposed to be on. I believe this is the April one. Okay, so let's go ahead. Now, and I don't have my glass. Y'all, I'm just so all over the place. But you guys know me. I'm always all over the place. So, you know, we deal with it. All righty. Got to put on my readers, honey. And these lashes as long as AF. Okay. Um. First thing I have here is this Dose of Colors. Is this an eyeliner? Eyeliner, yeah. Looks like it's green. That's what it looks like, according to that. That's what I'm going to guess that it's green. Um, which I'm pretty sure it's nice. It's nice packaging and everything. I don't want to open it and use it because I'm most likely going to put this in the giveaway. But yeah, this is what it is. And Dose of Color has some really nice products. I think I have one black one that I got before, which is really nice. But um, most likely I'm not going to keep the green. Not that there's nothing wrong with green, of course. But I probably won't get it. I mean, keep it. So that Dose of Colors is $15. 
uh, Rose Quartz from Nail Ink London. Mm, it's a do up. Look at that. Very nice. One has some some particles in it. I don't know why I said particles, but it has some. Oh, both of them have something in it. Anyway, is this for nail? This says nail ink. Let me see. Feeling vibrations in your ink. Incredible. Incredible. <laughs> okay. Crystal ball roller gloss. Oh, gloss. Okay. Crystal ball roller gloss duo. All right. Now this sounds intriguing. So this I probably will keep pretty, pretty sure of it. Got things in them. I like things. Look at that. Yet. Things. Look at that. That's the purple one. Okay. Very reminiscent of having like some lavender. And this has white, white ones. Look at that. Very nice, man. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so their lip gloss. So I'm just gonna put it on my hand. I could put it on my lips because I only have lip gloss on right now. I just have this uh, Rihanna, one of these. Um, you know, I just used these uh, in today's video. I've had these like since they first came out. I have uh, four of them, and um, this is the first time I've ever used one of the. These are really really nice, by the way. Off topic. Okay, but anyway, so. Yeah, it's just like a, a normal, probably lip gloss. I probably would use it more of a lip balmish type thing. Yeah, instead of because it's clear, so I wouldn't really wear. I mean, you know, when I'm going somewhere and need some moist lips, I would wear this. Not so much as a uh, topper or anything like that. But anyway, and I'm sorry, I forgot to smell it. I wanted to smell it. Nothing major. Nothing major. Try this side. No, they both smell the same to me. To me, they both smell the same. I don't know. But they're nice. Nice, shiny. Looks like they have a lot of lubrication. So, yeah, this would be nice. Uh, I'll definitely use one. Most likely, I'm going to take one with me. Guys, another reason I haven't been recording. Like, ever since February, we've been going away at least for a four-day weekend ever since February. We went February, we went last month, and honestly, this coming Monday, we will be going from Monday to Thursday again. This coming Monday, which is the 12th, we are going on another family vacation. Next thing that we have here is NARS blush. I love NARS blushes, guys. I love NARS blushes. And I forgot to tell you how much that duo was. See? See, see, see. This is what happens when your girl don't record and get all discombobulated. What is this? What am I doing? Twenty-four dollars for the roller door. I like the roller door. I'm gonna put one right in my purse, honey. Okay, so this nard. Oh, oh my gosh. Yep. Typical packaging from Nars. This color is uh, Desire. Okay desire a nice pinky color i'm guessing it goes good with anyone's skin tone it looks as i don't know it looks i don't know i don't know no i don't think it, this is not a good color for every skin tone so i'll take that back so you know i'm guessing uh boxy did it according to you know everyone's profile but yeah this one would go good with me i can do good with it it's a little pinky i tend to do little darker ones but I do do pinky like this but this isn't super super pink so it's not bad but I'm always excited to get a uh, um, high quality product like NARS so you won't have no complaints from me um, about this one so yeah and the NARS blush is um, $30 yes and then we have Laura Mercier um, caviar stick eye color okay eye color so this is like a shadow stick a lot of people don't like shadow sticks but i do i definitely use these on the go and when i'm on my little uh vacation days i take one of these and because i don't take a lot of makeup with me 
Um, I take something very, very simple that I throw on and go. I don't take stuff that I got to do a whole lot of blending and all that. No, I don't have time for that because I have a family of men and we be ready to go. We got plans, itineraries to follow. Um, so, yeah. That is that color. I didn't see the color. It is cashmere. Very pretty. I guess I could at least show y'all. See, y'all. Your girl is slipping for real. But anyway, the color is... Y'all know I'm not fond of pink. For me to say I'm not fond of pink, I have done so many damn pink looks. Come on. Um. No, well, okay, that's the wrong thing. This is really like, this is like a Barbie pink, huh? That's way too pink for me. Um, yeah, I probably never used that. That's why I shouldn't have did that. I could have gave it away. It's too late now, but yeah. But anywho, um, yeah, that's too pink. I won't say that I'm not fond of pink because that's not a true statement. I do like pink. I like pink a lot. Just not my favorite, favorite color. My favorite color is purple, guys. I love purple. That is my thing. Purple, purple, purple. But anyway, um, that was $29. Dang, I wish I hadn't uh, did that. I could have gave that away. But anyway, and then it looks like, is this the last thing? Oh, then there's one more thing in here. And then it looks like this iconic London palette, Sunret, Sunset to Sunrise Eyeshadow Palette. Very, very nice, pretty packaging. Very pretty. Here are the colors. I don't want to take the plastic off because you guys know this may show up in a giveaway. Guys, I have too many palettes still. My goal when 21, 21, when 2021 started was for me to do more looks using all these unused palettes. And I barely did it, y'all. Barely made a dent. And then I go out here and buy stuff like I'm crazy. That's why I'm on a no buy because I can't buy. I, I just can't. I don't have... Not that I don't have the room. I don't have the time. No, it's not even that I don't have the time. Because I do have the time too. Because I don't do nothing. I just don't use them. Because I don't wear makeup enough. <sighs> and you would think that I would just come in here every day. Because I don't work and just sit in here and do makeup. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not me, honey. But anyway, y'all. I'm crazy. And then lastly, it looks like we have the dry volume spray. Oh, so like a dry shampoo. Is that what that is? I don't use dry shampoo on my real hair, really, but I have used it on wigs uh, quite a few times, you know, for shine and things. So this will come in handy. But anyway, and I forgot to tell you again, any the dry, the balloon dry volume, volume spray is $32. And then the iconic London, oh, the iconic London sunset to sunrise eyeshadow palette excuse me $62 that is the price of the box right there $62 wow $62 okay all right and let's go ahead and get into the boxy pop-up stuff that I got now this time guys I spent well I won't say this time I spent um $101 on all this stuff most of this stuff is going to go to you guys like I said um I don't have the prices here all I know is that I spent $101 I don't usually buy from boxy pop-up I, I usually don't but because I knew that I was going to have a giveaway coming up just like a giveaway just because just because um, I just decided to go ahead and because I know boxy pop-up has like the cheapest prices and they have really good quality products that you know we get in our boxy charm and stuff like that great great brands for great great prices okay so that's why I decided to go ahead and do it this time okay so anywho um, the first thing that I got was this glam in paradise gold what is it I can't I should get my glasses um, gold foil mask infused with uh, cannabis the Tiva seed oil and yeah it's a three part mask this is nice I got two of them and you know a lot of this stuff I may look shocked for guys because like I said I I don't even remember what I purchased <laughs> I really don't um yeah so I'm pretty sure like I said I know it was a good price because that's why I got it but anyway so I got two of them so I'm pretty sure I probably got one for me and one to put in a giveaway I don't know I'll figure out all that when it's time to do the the giveaway but yeah so this is a three-part mask I remember that um I think it has one for like the I can't see it's not telling me what's in here that's what I'm trying to tell you guys oh here it is okay so it's a face mask a eye mask and a lip mask so yeah it's a three-part I don't know if this was in any of the boxy charms but like I said I didn't miss one um 
this year so I, I don't know um you know I don't know I mean not this when did I miss it okay that's not important but anyway <laughs> so yeah that's what that is it's a three-part mask so that's that the next thing that I got did I get any more of these oh the next thing that I got was some glamnetic lashes and y'all know I always uh, was talking about these and how much how expensive they are but I know that when I saw these they were not the normal price that I paid um the $30 or $32 whatever they are so yeah I know they were a really, really good place I believe they were like um six or nine dollars um so yeah so I decided to just go ahead and get that as well as the matching um liner glue which normally costs 36 dollars so yeah i know that i got a really good deal on that i wish i had the prices for you guys but i do not um yeah i just don't i'm sorry so yeah i got that and what else i got this kat von d lash primer which i've never had a lash primer and i'm really excited about this this is for me all right and then it looks like I got, let's see, vitamin C bright and glow facial sheet mask. Um, it is five sheet masks in here. You can never go wrong with face masks from Boxy Charm or the Ipsy, even though I don't get Ipsy anymore, but good price. And this is, oh, eye mask, avocado hydrating eye mask. There are three pair in here. All right and what else this is the kush lash primer as well i believe this is a lash primer isn't it oh brow gel my bad <laughs> this is uh um milk makeup kush brow gel all right and then i got let's see my daily dose of glow illuminate and brighten um this is by skin skin ink love glow oil love it love it love it i mean i wear it all year round but super super love it in the summertime love it love it love it very nice okay and then the next thing i got was this kat von d brow pomade this is a dark brown I don't need to really take this stuff out. I'm pretty sure you guys know what this stuff looks like. Because like I said, I'm not sure which one. Oh, this color is walnut. Which one I'm putting um, in the giveaway and what I'm keeping. Most of the stuff I do know. And um, the next thing I got was this Good Apple Foundation. By oh my gosh. All right, guys. Let's rewind here. Okay. I just realized that when I just picked this up, this uh, Kat Von D, uh, KVD um, Good Apple Foundation that, you know, everybody's been talking about that's going around. Um, I realized that this was not from Boxy <laughs> Pop Up. I must have put my cat, uh, K okay, K -Von KVD. I got to stop calling it Cat Von D. Okay, my KVD <laughs> products um, in with my Boxy Pop Up stuff. So these three things that I got are not from Boxy Pop Up. So I'm going to just boop, 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 erase and let's just forget I said anything about these three things. Okay, because they're going to be there's going to be a video on this uh, stuff coming up okay so let's just forget that and I don't want to edit that so let's just forget that okay um anyway and the next thing I got was this uh Kat Von D now this I know I did get from um uh the pop-up because I remember I did have a Kat Von D uh product now this one is a lip cream yeah this one is a lip cream let's see I don't know if I, I don't believe I would have got this for me though, but I, I don't know. But anyway, it's a color that I would wear. This is a color that anyone can, can wear. I'm not going to open it because uh, I'm not sure, but it is pretty, very, very pretty, very pretty, very pretty packaging as well. Next thing I got was this Milk Makeup um, Kush Lash Primer. Oh, I got another lash primer. See? I didn't know that either um yeah here it is right here i'm pretty sure this is from me because i wanted primers to try to make my bottom lashes look a little more um lengthening it has something on here but you know i'm not familiar with lash primers i don't usually get them but i know you know since i wear lashes that doesn't mean i don't 
I can't wear lash primers on my top lashes, but generally I don't. I mainly wanted it for the bottom, like I said, to, you know, try to give them some length in so that they can show more. You know what I'm saying? So that's basically why I got this packaging is everything. It's nice and heavy metal. This is nice. I know this is probably for me. So nice little lash primer. So, yeah. Okay. And the next thing it appears to be some Fenty products. Oh, Fenty lip products. Here we go. And I'm, you know, like I said, it's some pop-ups, so I know it wasn't expensive. But I probably got these for you guys. I'm pretty sure. Of, yep. Because, uh, yeah, I wouldn't wear this color. I don't want to take the packaging all the way out. But it looks like I just did. <laughs> but, yeah, this is a color. I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely too bright for me. I would not, uh, I wouldn't wear that color. I mean, that's me. Um, but, you know, it's pretty. It's very pretty. I just feel like it might be too bright. I don't know. I'm pretty sure if I had on the right thing, I could make it work. But I'm pretty sure I bought it for the giveaway. I'm 100% positive I bought both of these. Or maybe one of these. I don't know. And here's the other. Oh, this one's more of a hot pinkish. Where that one was more of a hot, like, I mean, uh, like a more of a coral color. This one is more hot pinkish. It's cute. I like this too. But still, I wouldn't wear this one either. I don't like bright colors. I don't know why. Not lipsticks. So, yeah. Another giveaway item. Try to keep the packaging intact. Oh, and yeah, they both are Fenty. All right, and then we have some kind of water. I know it can't be water, it has to be spray because, I, like I said, I don't like uh, micellar water. I really don't. I mean, I'll use it every now and then, especially now that I've been using it more when I do, um, uh, when I'm going to clean up my eye and stuff. So, yeah, it gives me a reason to use it a little more. So yeah, I knew it had to be spray. Um, so this probably is some rose spray. Yep. Yep. Hydrating face spray. Rose. I love it. Love it. Love it. I have so many open now. Woo! Smells like ro Oh, this smells good, good. Good, good. Who's it by? Cores? I don't know. I can't see that. But, you know. Beautiful. Smells super good. Super good. Another spray to add. And y'all see I still got this $90 water back here. I got this water. I got a couple more in there. <sighs> okay. And so here we go. This is the last of my pop-up. And these are palettes, which I know 100% I would have bought all these palettes for the giveaway. All right. And let's see, some of them are not open, so I'm not going to open them. This one is the OPV Beauty Spotlight Eyeshadow Palette. This is the outer packaging. It's covered in plastic, but I'm pretty sure it's cute. Um, um, but if I can get a picture of it, I will put it on the side here so that you can um, see the, with the colors inside. All right, and then the next one is this Hip Dot palette. Hip Dot shadows are so nice. I think I used um, one palette, and I've used it like three times. Yeah, that's shocking for me, but I used it like three times. Um, it wasn't this palette, but the one that I had was really, really nice. This is pretty. I don't know about this, y'all. Mm -mm. I might have to keep this bad boy. This is pretty. I like these colors. I do. I like these colors. I don't know about that. Oh no, this is pretty. But anyway, um, this is the other one, another one rather. And then we have, let me put it back into the. Y'all, y'all may be getting some blank spaces, but y'all know Tanika does not like to edit. And there is no shame in that for me. I just don't like to do it. Um, but you know, when it calls for it, it calls for it, but I don't like to do it. So anywho, so we have here, 
um some huda beauty palettes now it this one is the huda beauty obsessions palette okay i'm not sure if i have this one or not i don't know i don't feel like looking but these are the beautiful colors right here this is pretty too very very pretty now with this one the obsession one um I got two. I'm not sure if it was because I was planning on keeping one for me or if I was doing it for a giveaway. I don't know. Um, oh, yeah. I have it. <laughs> I have it. So, and never used it. Never even used it, guys. Told y'all. But anyway, see, this is my unused makeup. I told y'all on that side. But anyway, okay. So they were, So I'm guessing they both, all of it will be in the giveaway. So that's um, that. And this one is the Huda Beauty Amethyst Obsessions Palette. The purple one that I love. Now this one, I know that I do have there. All right. So this is the pretty colors on this one. But for some reason, I only have one on this. I don't know why. I just have one. And then this is um, the Coral Obsessions by Huda Beauty. Pretty as well. And I did get to it. Whoa. Come on. Okay. Try not to be rough with the packaging. And I have two of those as well. Okay. So, yeah. A pretty big um, boxy pop-up this in. Like I said, I spent $101. And I'm very happy with everything I got. Most of it, again, is going to go to you guys. And that is it for this video today, guys. Um, there is a video on this look as well as this hair. So, I'm not going to talk about that because I will link it in the card above or put it down below or both. I really appreciate you watching today, guys. If you have not done so already, please hit the subscribe button, like, and comment, and I'll see you in the next video.